Hello everybody, I'm Jenny of Pampering by LJ and welcome to my channel. time for my reflection for this past week so past week first week of April and so let's talk a little bit about how I did related to the goals that I've set myself up for April so first goal number one was during the weekend only have one day or night of indulgences and so my steps for that goal are to track that goal every single week so I'm tracking it thinking about last weekend and how I did on my eating and drinking and I only had one day slash night of indulgences and so that was last Saturday night we went out for dinner and drinks and I had a marvelous time so but it was just one time over the weekend so I did really great in fact when I look back at my food tracker and drink tracker for the past week I earned blue dots every day except for Saturday which that's when I made the choice to go out and it worked out beautifully because then Friday night Sunday Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday flash forward to today I did really great and was very consistent on my eating drinking as I can look back at my tracker and see because I got blue dots which means I stayed right in my healthy guidelines every day that I wanted to so feeling very good about the work I did on that step for towards my goal for this month number two incorporate weekly walking with my book on tape and daily stretching. So how do I do with that? I did come back to my daily stretching. I did pretty well on that. I don't think I accomplished it every single day, but enough days that I definitely can tell a difference in my body, stretching uh, my feet, my back, my hips, feeling better right this second than I did two weeks ago so I would say that that part of the goal was accomplished I did listen to my book on tape the shift that's that book that I'm reading or listening to all about shifting my mindset and I listened to that I think every day pretty much this past week I didn't incorporate physical activity by going on walks outside and things like that the weather's been pretty horrend horrendous, so I didn't do that, and I didn't go to the gym to walk on the treadmill. So I didn't incorporate um, walking, but I did incorporate the stretching and the mind piece with listening to the book on tape. So didn't meet all of that strategy this week, but I met some of it, so that was a good thing. Number three, the third step is to track my food intake every single day in my Weight Watchers points builder and I completed that. Everything I've had, eating, drinking, everything has gone in there so I definitely met that goal too. So I am really on my way to meeting my April goals so I had a great first week on that. And remember for the month of April my, fo my focus is balance and consistency and hoping to lose five pounds in April. Five weigh-ins, five pounds. So am I on track to do that? I feel like I am on track, very successful. Um, I did weigh in this morning and I did have a loss of 1.2. So that was great. I liked seeing that negative 1.2 um, based on you know from last Friday to this Friday that's a good thing so I liked that as well so that's how I did for this first week of April as you know on Fridays I try to get prepared for next week's meal plan by getting my grocery shopping done and my meal planning thought of maybe even written down um, today 
I did, I do have a plan in mind for this next week. I haven't put it pen to paper yet, but I knew that I needed to go ahead and go by the grocery store on the way home tonight on Friday night so that when the next week rolls around, I'm ready to go. So I already have a good game plan in my mind of what I am, go am going to have to eat next week. I haven't put pen to paper yet, but I will this weekend. But I did pick up all of the necessary items produce-wise that I needed. It's pretty good on meats. In fact, I'm great on meat because I went uh, to Sam's Club last weekend. So I'm really great there. But I did need to replace meats and vegetables or canned goods and uh, produce in the refrigerator. So just had a few items to pick up. So I'm ready to go for next week. I'll be putting together another meal plan this week too. I'm consistently doing that every single week. It's helping me out a lot. Thanks for joining me today. I hope you guys had a great week. And as always, I will be back next Friday or Saturday to check in with you again.